Well then, uh, having seen some disturbing news and views from venues that are not necessarily dependable, perhaps many of them belonging to the disinformation multitudes that are prepared by very, very gifted, talented ent entities in service of a darker leader, we shall then attempt to make some form of a poetic discourse on a subject that seems to be really, really ramping up in August. The lion is the symbol of August and therefore this will be the appropriate icon for the following poem. August 2012. August 2012 seems a signature month in the searing summer of global discontent. Messages received are sent to masses who may or may not understand the handwriting on the walls. Serious summer calls to awake, to arms, seem to sing to some nambulant swarms of sheeple. Shepherds have desensitized most of them that they might be herded to moribund pastures. Hard, sharp slaps in numb faces chase sleep from some, though they be far too few in number. Far too few to do anything to alter the course of events programmed patiently long ago. Events worldwide in August of 2012, in a summer of strange sounds, sights, and serious savageries, seem as pinpricks in the benumbed minds of many that the few prickers may gauge effects of agenda mandates calling for the fates of the masses to be finalized in frenzied faux pas. Songbirds of every stripe are ripe for pursuit by those who shoot them with myriad methods. Myths and legends abound, most to be found in preponderous portions prepared by programmers. Hammers of insulting arrogance fall upon the heads of couch potatoes and sports bar flies, along with many who imagine themselves to be true patriots of America, which no longer is the home of the free. Some may choose to flee as our flag falls to ground where the crown has ruled for centuries of deceit. Where will they run to is the question with no good answers as dancers of death don new shoes. Elites strike up the band and prepare to brand sheeple, some for enslaved servitude, some for savage slaughter, in a searing summer of deep discontent. Then comes the fall. Adieu.